What's up YouTube? What's up to all my subscribers and welcome to another sorry about that of my review videos. So um like I promised I'm gonna be reviewing Need for Speed Shift for the PS3. So I want you guys to know that this is all based on my personal opinion and the reason why I say that is because I really think that everybody has your personal taste when it comes to racing games. I mean, you probably like more arcade games like uh, Need for Speed Underground, or you're more for the kind of simulation games like, um, how is it called, Forza or uh, Gran Turismo, or you're per between both like Grid or Dirt 2. Personally, I like Grid, I'm in the kind of middle, like between simulation and arcade, that's what I like, like Grid or Dirt. and this game is more on in the simulation side okay it's more like Forza and Gran Turismo so personally I would say this game wasn't really for me I mean I loved Grid I loved Dirt and when I saw the game when I saw the videos I never got the demo or anything like that I just got it thinking it would be more like Dirt or Grid and I was wrong it's more Forza kinda game it's more uh, Need for Speed, uh, uh, Gran Turismo game. So the game wasn't really for me. It's good. I mean, it's good, but I like when there's a little bit of arcade in it. Uh, there's a big variety of car you can choose from Nissan to uh, Lamborghinis to uh, McLaren and really nice cars. I mean, really, really a big variety of cars. Um, there's you have a. Uh, the events you can have in the game is racing events, drift events that are f fucking hard, okay? They're fucking fucking hard. And that's what I hated about the game, I mean, the drifting was not fun. I didn't have fun at all, it was actually really frustrating. Races were kind of fun, sometimes frustrating, but between both, frustrating and fun. So, I would like to have more fun than frustrating and not frustrating at all like dirt was really good uh so for the graphics the graphics are really really good i mean it's probably the best racing game uh that i've ever seen visually uh the controls are really hard to a master i mean that's what makes the game frustrating it's actually the controls um Online, online never lags. I mean, this is for the PS3 and it never lags. It's uh, actually pretty fun. The idea is really good. Uh, the only thing I didn't like, it's not my kind of game, so I didn't appreciate it online at all. It's even harder online. Um, what else? Uh, so, just to answer, probably a lot of people will have this question, do you buy this or you buy Dirt 2? Uh, I would actually go with Dirt 2 and not with this, um, although it's a really good game, but not for me. Um, so that's about it, guys. Uh, if I had to give it a rating out of 10, it would be kind of hard. It would be between 7.5 and 8 out of 10. Uh, but if you plan buying the game, I hardly recommend you to rent it before, like really, really badly, or go to, I think it's EA.com and you can actually have the demo for your computer, but it, if you don't have a graphic card, good graphic card, just go and rent it because, I mean, it's a, it's a strange game. It's not strange, but I mean, it, it's really simulation, but it has a little bit of arcade in it. so. It's really based on your personal opinion, so go and rent it. Anyways, guys, uh, this is all for my review. Peace out, subscribe, and uh, more videos to come. Peace.